Hey everyone, this evening I'm going to show you how to make a dump cake, or in my area we might call it a uh, cobbler. You can make it with any kind of fruit, you can make it with blackberries, you can make it with peaches, you can make it with pineapples and cherries, and blueberries and strawberries, just any type of fruit. It uh, takes about 20 to 30 minutes, on average about 25 minutes, to bake in a Dutch oven. It's really tasty, it's really good, and you'll enjoy it at your campsite. And I've got to thank a good friend by the name of Lloyd Chandler. He showed me how to fix this at the spring meetup this past June. So, Lloyd, thank you very much. Hope you enjoy the recipe, folks. Okay. I'm going to show you a real easy and quick way to make a Dutch oven dessert for your camping trips. Or just around the house, whatever you want to do. You know, some people call these a dump cake around here locally, where I'm from. It's more of a cobbler. But basically, you take any kind of fruit. You can take, like in today's case, I'm going to take blueberries and a strawberry pie filling. But you can take blackberries. You can take pineapples and cherries. Uh, you can take just pretty much anything you want to take to make this. Okay. I'm going to take my strawberry put them in the pan or in the Dutch oven I'll take my blueberries I'm gonna dump them in as well then I'm gonna take a plain old yellow cake and I will empty it in some type of mixing bowl Then you'll take Sprite or 7-Up and you'll pour it into the cake mix. Start off with just a little bit. Mix it up. And simply pour it over your fruit, whatever it is, whether it's pineapples and cherries, or whether it's strawberries and blueberries, like in this case, I put my lid on, now it's time to get my coals ready, so then I grab my coals, them on top like so spread these out on the ground and set my Dutch oven on top of it okay folks we're gonna call this done mighty fine looking cobbler there I must say Tastes pretty good too. Thanks for watching, folks. Hope you enjoy the recipe. That's good.